So today guys, I am now moved on to the Renault 5. I've removed the bonnet because the bonnet opens this way, awkward. So I've removed that and I'm gonna start taking bits out of here. There's actually nothing apart from the gearbox that I'll be reusing, um, obviously the main of the car, but none of the ancillaries or anything to the engine, not even the radiator. So I'm gonna pull everything out, create myself some room and then start trying to mock up how I'm gonna get the other engine in. What I have noticed is it's a lot taller so we're gonna to have to come up with some sort of solution with the bonnet, whether we raise it a little bit, put a hump in it, I, I don't know yet. But that is something that we will deal with when we come to it. So let's get on stripping it down. the Renault 5 turbo engine out of the vehicle. So my plan now is to remove the gearbox. There was some issues with the box. It kept spitting itself out of second gear. So we're gonna send that off, um, get that reconditioned, and it does bolt up to our, our two litre engine. So we'll be using this gearbox. Then I will have to get it all mounted into place. Obviously that engine mounted into place. I'm gonna to have to make an engine mount for the front of it. Uh, the other three mounts are off the gearbox, so that saves me a bit of a job. We're going to clean this engine bay down because it's had various oil leaks and stuff and it's looking a bit grubby. So Tom McGuire is going to send me some cool stuff to clean this up, make it look pretty again. I'm going to remove all the unwanted bracketry, uh, all the unwanted wiring, hoses, get rid of the fuel pressure regulator um, and then go from there. So I've got the gearbox off of the old Renault 5 turbo engine. It's in the back of the van. We're gonna go see our friends over at MK Gearbox, give it to them. Um, yeah, let them have a look over it really and just see what the problem is. It was popping out of second gear. We did have some problems with it previously when, um, when we had to remove the gearbox. One of the inner CVs had fallen apart and the needle bearings had fallen into the box. Um, we did manage to do a few bits to get it back together, to get it on the road, but it looks like it's done some damage. So we're just gonna get them to overhaul it, replace whatever needs replacing. So we're on our way there now. 
charge the fish with your camera. <laughs> Marvellous. Thank you. Hope you're not in a rush. No. Sweet boy, you can get on for it. Yeah, that's all right. Q building up over there, so. It is what it is, just whatever you get on Friday, so. <laughs> well, this well, Friday. Can only get one, you get done, done. I'll be back on Monday, but. Okay. Yeah, cool, mate. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. That's class. Yeah. Yeah. No worries. Thank you, mate. I'll speak to you later. Bye. 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 Love you. Hello. Why have you that? <laughs> I don't know. Have I got one too? No, no, you haven't, no. <laughs> what the? <laughs> what is going on? What are you doing? I don't know. Anyway. Um, so, basically, Ed, I spoke to Ed, and Ed told me that... Um, Basically, <laughs> basically, that they're universal, and they they're universal, and basically it was no help at all. So I'm just gonna do it. I'm just gonna make something. I think. Can do what? Um. Well, hang on. Let me take this off. It's actually upsetting me now. How do I get rid of it? There we go. I'm back. Um. Yeah, I've, I'm going to strip down the one we've got and then just see what we've got working with us. I mean, it's a flat piece of bar at the end of the day, the, the, the adjuster part, isn't it? Yeah. So, we'll just... <laughs> <laughs> okay, yeah, so I'll, I'm just going to try and work something out, basically. So, I don't need to order anything or get anything? No, the only thing we need to do whilst I've got you on the phone... Oh, there's a shark here, look. Let me see him. Hmm? Yeah. Um, so we just need to. I don't know. We just need to order a fuel pump. A fuel pump. Yes. Not as well as fuel pressure regulator. Yeah, you seem upset. No, no, just so I know. <laughs> yeah. So <laughs> that one suits you. Let me try and find. Oh, harsh. What is it? Oh, that one. <laughs> stick your tongue out. Uh, stick your tongue out. <laughs> What's up? <laughs> Alright, anyway. Um, yeah, so the fuel pump, I will send you a link over if you could just order it, yeah? Roger that. Oh, you're beautiful. Uh, look for the bare necessities. <laughs> Yeah, that was a good one. Same shit, different day. Nice, that's a good one. <laughs> alright, cool, yeah, I'll send you a link over, alright? <laughs> For fuck's sake. No problem. Alright, I'll speak to you soon. Bye. Love you, bye.